फाइव सेकेंड्स टू गो स्टार्ट द रिवेन्यू बींग एग्रीड बाय द डिसीजन ऑफ द बोर्ड फाइल्ड टैक्स रिविजन पेटिशन बिफोर द हाई कोर्ट अंडर सेक्शन एटी सिक्स टू ऑफ द एक्ट द हाई कोर्ट डिसमिस्ड द रिविजन पेटिशन फाइल्ड बाय द रिवेन्यू एंड अपहेल्ड द डिसीजन ऑफ द बोर्ड बाय होल्डिंग दैट द रिस्पोंडेंट यूनिट इज ए प्रेस्टिजियस यूनिट एंड देयर फोर एंटाइटल्ड टू सेवेंटी फाइव परसेंट टैक्स एग्जम्पन्स अंडर द स्कीम एग्रीव्ड बाय द ऑर्डर सो पास्ड बाय द हाई कोर्ट द रिवेन्यू इज बिफोर अस इन दिस अपील वी हैव हियर्ड लर्नड काउंसिल फॉर द पार्टीज टू द केस एंड परूज द डॉक्यूमेंट्स ऑन रिकॉर्ड एज वेल एज द ऑर्डर पास्ड बाय द अथॉरिटीज एंड द हाई कोर्ट रिस्पेक्टिवली द लर्नड सीनियर काउंसिल अपेयरिंग फॉर द अपीलांट सबमिट्स दैट द केस प्लीडिड बाय रिस्पोंडेंट यूनिट राइट फ्रॉम द बिगिनिंग ऑफ फाइलिंग द एप्लीकेशन बिफोर द स्टेट लेवल स्क्रीनिंग कमेटी वॉज दैट द न्यू यूनिट हैड मेड एन इन्वेस्टमेंट ऑफ मोर देन रुपीज फाइव हंड्रेड क्रोड्स बाय वे ऑफ फिक्सड कैपिटल असेट्स एंड देयर फोर दे शुड बी प्लेस्ड अंडर द कैटेगरी ऑफ प्रेस्टिजियस यूनिट एंड अकॉर्डिंगली बी ग्रांटिड एलिजिबिलिटी सर्टिफिकेट to claim 75% of exemption from tax for the maximum time limit provided under the scheme in aid of this submission the learned senior counsel would draw your attention to the application and the accompanying affidavit filed by the respondent unit before the state level screening committee he would further contend that the respondent unit before all the authorities below including the high court had adopted the stand that the fixed capital investment excluding investment made before 5th march 1997 was more than rupees 530 crores and therefore the respondent unit is a prestigious unit entitled to an exemption of 75% of total tax liability it is further contended that the respondent new unit being new cement unit and further being large scale unit though can avail the benefit of the incentive scheme under 1e of annexer c which provides for exemption up to 25% of total liabilities it cannot avail the benefit of exemption at the rate of 75% under item 4 as prestigious unit he would further submit that benefit to cement industry is confined to the extent envisaged under the item 1e of annexer c as the said item is a specific provision relating to cement industry alternatively it is contended that the respondent unit being new cement unit it may fall under new very prestigious unit however item 5 of annexer c speaks of the new very prestigious units other than cement units except those located in sub plan area respondent unit may not be entitled to avail the benefit of the scheme per contra learned counsel would justify the reasoning and the conclusion reached by the high court while rejecting the revenues revision petition and therefore thereby 
confirming the view expressed by the board he would inter alia submit that item 1e is only an exception to the general rule envisaged in item 1 and note an exception to the other items in the annexure c that is items 2 to 7 as it is not intended to govern the entire field of exemptions made available to the cement industry so as to deny the benefits to a unit even if it falls under another item and we saying better incentives he would further submit that since new cement unit is specifically excluded from application of item 1 item 2 and item 5 but not item 4 item 6 and item 7 it falls that the intention behind such express ex- exclusion is such that but for the said exclusion cement industries would be included in the said entries he would strenuously submit that since the tax exemption clauses are made with a beneficent object that is to encourage investment in specified rural semi urban areas their construction must be liberal such as to confer the most beneficial meaning to the provisions the facts which are not in dispute are that the respondent assessi established a new cement unit within panchayat samiti and commenced commercial production sometime in the year 1997 it engaged itself in the manufacture of cement the total capital investment in the new industrial unit claimed by the company was rupees 532 crores the company had applied for grant of eligibility certificate for exemption from payment of central sales tax and rajasthan sales tax before the state level screening committee jaipur under this scheme however the screening committee accepted only rupees 55.32 crores as fci eligible for availing the benefits under the scheme on the aforesaid basis the state level screening committee certified that the company is entitled to avail exemption of tax to the extent of 25% of the tax liability by treating the same to be a large scale industry in the appeal the board took the view it has the status of new prestigious unit this falls within the definition stop